like it too. All right, we back. Now just read that one part again. That just read, this is, you know, for the new video. Yeah, 924 and 60. You shall hear wars and rumors of wars. See that you be not trouble for all these things must come to pass. Wars and rumors of wars, that's what we've been hearing about. I mean, what's in the news right now? Oh, Iran, your like, brother just read it in the previous video. Threatening to shut down the Strait of Hormuz, that's gonna cause war. You got that whole situation popping down in Venezuela. Russia down there, United States is down there. They say China's down there. You know what I mean? They got a shit popping off of North, North Korea. They, they said they, they, they detected more nuclear activity. There's always this talk of war. And like America is constantly a war. Going to all these other nations, fucking, fucking shit up. They're the ones provoking these people. In the main war, everybody talking about Oh, shit. I will slow the fuck down. I will slow the fuck down. What a, that, that's what I do too. Yeah. Slow the fuck down, go at a move at a pull. People get, can learn how to control your rage. <laughs> that's a road rage right there. These people are quick to rap. Like you said, I'll be quick to rap. Yeah. I learned that driving, bro. Learn you gotta calm down. I ain't never had it, bro. I gotta calm down. Down cool. I'd be happy I'd be at a red light, you know what I mean? Uh-oh. That's pick your tail right I guess she is. Oh man, I was watching this video yesterday. Oh goodness. I was watching this video and this woman she came up, she had a nice hourglass figure. You like if you seen her walk down street, you'd be like, whoo! Right, right. But she took her shirt off, she had a girdle on. Oh. She popped that girdle off and it was like <laughs> Right, right, right. Wow. They, they lying to you out here. They see her, she a devil. She that's a evil. devil, yeah, that's a deceiver. Yeah. That's why dude, we live in the age of Viagra, man. You, these bitches don't turn you on looking at them no more, man. Stomach's You gotta get a jump start and shit. You gotta hook the car up to your shit. That's <laughs> good. I don't like, get turned on just by cause a bitch pretty and got a pussy. I don't get that shit. There, I had too much between pussy. There's, there's fine ass bitch. women everywhere. Right. There, there's no shortage of women. None. They think they're so special. When there's really a shortage of men. Yeah. There's way more women than men. And this bitch think her ass is better than the other bitch's ass. But that's why they always advertising they shit. Ass is just that special one. Like they some like kind of new creature we ain't right. seen before. Like Pinky's nasty ass. This just thinks she's the perfect woman. They enjoying the day, ain't they? That's that murder. I would not let my son ride a bike downtown that age. Who goes riding down? Let's go. He probably lives down here, actually. You know these devils, they get rich ass, these expensive ass condos and apartments. Expensive ass condos. Expensive as hell. They be riding their uh, $5,000 bicycles. You see it? Yeah, they got some folks more than that, too. Yeah. Shit, bicycle, a bike. A bicycle. And you gotta pedal that motherfucker. It don't help you when you tired and you gotta make it home. <laughs> You can't turn on the motor and shit. That $5,000 bike, you gotta pick it up and walk. Hey, I hit, I hit them big hills. Sometimes I get it, I'm about to get this hill. But sometimes like, boy, I might have to walk this one. You know that shit? You like dead after this. $5,000 bike. People actually got that wealth to spend on a bike. On a bike. On a bike. And they take it home and they actually hang it. Yeah, on hang the it wall. up on the wall. That's sweet though. Yeah, That's yeah. Sweet, but they, they treat it good. Yeah. <laughs> I've been trying to treat mine good. Because it's an investment, I guess. Yeah, it is guess, an investment. You know? And it holds its value. Likes. Yeah, take yep. care of it. That's crazy, yo. Yep. He's got to be a devil. He's got to go. They really do, man. Fuck that, man. The king, I'm just going to have a bird. For real. Yeah, yeah you hey, know? I was thinking about it. We're going to ride that's like the show Lord of the Rings, right, right on a, a big yeah. ass eagle. Yeah. A giant yeah. eagle. Yeah, or any other people. A dragon. Yeah. I was watching Game of Thrones. <laughs> that shit dope, man. That shit dope, man. Hey, I heard that they used to do that. You ever hear of the uh, the Thunderbird down in South America? Yeah, 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 they yeah. say it's a mythical yeah. creature. Right. But that shit was real. 
Now, I heard people used to ride on back of Thunderbirds. That's crazy. <laughs> I don't doubt it. I don't doubt it. I don't doubt it. It's a strange fucking world. It's much stranger than what we see now. Oh, but that'd be scary, boy. Be right. Woo I can't wait. Call my bird or whatever to let it, you know. Yeah, yeah. And hell, if you fall off the bird, he can catch you. So an, air, an airplane can't catch you if you fall out of that. Oh, I seen that. Uh, yeah, they're trying to wipe out Scoop. That ain't gonna happen. No, you gonna have that. I don't claim me a big ticket today. Let's do normal, man. He's gonna eat more, man. Let's lead to these motherfuckers to see the chip. Yeah, she didn't eat more. I mean, I'll take whatever the low one get me. That's meth 24 and uh. <laughs> Hold on, my girl right here, though. I'll take it off. Go ahead. He said, what do you No, Well, I mean, yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, she is. Yeah, she is. He said, the nation shall rise against nation, the kingdom against kingdom. There shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Famines, we gotta slow down on that one. Famines and pestilence. Famines and pestilence, there are people gonna be hungry out That's just like some walking dead type shit. But you already got the pestilences with the diseases and all that. Plus everybody's gonna be hungry. People gonna be killing each other over food. Cause one, one, once a disaster hits, the food in the store gonna last about a day or two, if that. You see it when you get a big storm, you got a, a, a tornado warning. They go up in the store, you go to Kroger, Bro, the, the shelves be empty within hours. Just over a thunderstorm alert. Yeah, right. You know what I mean? Especially a snowstorm in the wintertime. Bro, could you imagine what's gonna happen when a when a big ass they get hit with a pestilence? They get hit with a disease or an epidemic. You know what I'm saying? And then that's when that fam is gonna come in. It ain't nobody, ain't too many people out here got stacked crowds of food. You go on most people's fridges, bro. Most first of all, most people are poor. The majority of people are poor. They don't have no kind of food or nothing. They got some ramen noodles. You know what I mean? Some Kool-Aid. That's about it. You be going up in some people's fridge and probably be empty. Think about it, though. Look at how many people are just literally one paycheck from being homeless. They have one paycheck from being homeless. That's almost everybody. Yeah. Most people have no savings at all. That's what they get from living carelessly anyway. That is carelessly. Yeah. You gotta make sure you got a little something. Right. This is Micah 5 15, and I will execute vengeance in anger and fury upon the heathen such as they have not heard. Dang, you're gonna execute vengeance of fury that they have not heard. Y'all gonna see it, man. Especially when the Lord returns, and we're gonna put these heathens to slavery. After the missiles hit, <laughs> and them chariots come out the sky. See, there's no people don't want to believe that, man. receive our rewards. When the Lord returns to the earth, they're going to say it's aliens. That's an alien invasion. That's how bugged out it's going to be. You know what I'm saying? The Lord going to let them, let them know who he is. They going to, what does scripture say? Every eye shall see him. What's that? Isaiah 34? <laughs> that's awesome, bro. Uh, Isaiah. I shall not be a man. Ain't that Isaiah? No, that's Isaiah. I will not be me as a man. He's just coming back to his full power. I will not be me as a man. These angels are claim to be seeing. When you actually all be seeing is just uh, some, uh, some, uh, some, uh, a result of your whatever dope you're doing. <laughs> but a lot of these motherfuckers do the same. The Lord's gonna come back. As a black man, well, he's no color. You ever heard that shit? The Lord's no color? Right, translucent man. The translucent Lord, he's all color. No, he's all color. All colors too. He's all colors so, and so no color. So now he's part of the Rainbow Coalition. 
And he has no colors. <laughs> he, he, he's all colors and see, he's the Lord can do that. He can be all colors and no colors. That's what they're gonna say. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you doubt the Lord's power? This nigga gonna bug the fuck out. Not a scripture, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Jesus, Jesus. Behold ye, behold ye among the heathen, and regard and wonder marvelously, for I will work and work in your days, which ye will not believe, though it be told you. <laughs> They're not gonna believe unless they be told. You tell them now, they don't believe it. Hell no. These, well, these are the assholes, they don't wanna believe that unless they see it. Yeah. No. They can't see that, that desolation. They can't see the movie Walking Dead on the road. Look at me, Ron. There are many other movies that he saw put out to let you know, let you know what he's going to do. These people just look at it and fuck it. Oh, that's Isaiah 47. Just look at that fucking entertainment, you man. Who the fuck are you with? Like when he said, you can see the storm coming. Yeah. But you can't. Discern the sign of the fucking times? They got no discernment. None. They got no perception. Hey, that's what that scripture means. Uh, was that uh, First John two and uh, something? He said, "You have an unction from the First John two and twenty. You have an unction from the Holy One, and you know all things." But when you look that word up, no, it's usually the word for no in Greek is what gnosis. But the word there is eidos, which means to actually to perceive. So we can perceive all things. Perceive. You got perception. These people got no perception. They got no perception of reality. They got a fuck. Oh no, they got a perception. They got a fucked up person. They got a twisted, mangled. They they don't even see what's really in front of their eye. What is scripture? They got eyes, but they can't see. Yeah, exactly. That's some real shit right there. Exactly. They got eyes, but they can't see, and ears, but they can't hear. That's crazy. Just looking around, you see, man, this is a scary fucking world. It really is. They don't see it. This is, man. This is a dangerous world, man. This is a really fucking is. dangerous fucking world. Esau set up as false perception of reality. That's what you call magic. He put a dark magical spell on these people. I'm going to get it out of here. I'm going to get it out of here. They don't get it. Deuteronomy 28, 66. And thy life shall hang in doubt before thee, and thou shalt fear day and night, and shalt have none assurance for thy life. Yeah, there's gonna be no insurance for your life. Hey, shit, there's no insurance for your life right now. That's a curse. That's why your boy was talking. Your boy just came up here and said somebody kicked his door down. He said he had to empty out 14 rounds on him. If you believe him. But he said he's living on the west side, so that's possible. Right? Then the NRA gave him some lessons. <laughs> the powder room, you can go He said he gave eighty dollars a month to the NRA. Yeah, you always learn how to by having the biggest dude. Yeah, they probably is lying. I ain't never get nobody know eighty dollars a month. Shit, you bad enough, you gotta pay these fucking bills. Go to the N. What is the NRA? Fuck the NRA. What's well, so I heard the NRA's uh that's just set up anyway. And I can imagine that. What's the other one? The gun owners of America or something? What's that called? There's two main groups. But the other group always says the NRA's a bunch of sellouts and they're fucking <laughs> and they don't have your best interest in mind. I forget what they was always on Alex Jones. I used to watch Alex Jones back in the day. And they would go in on how the NRA was really just set up by the, you know. Remember that bitch that came into uh, New Kent to the brothers? Talking about the black bitch, Alex Jones. Oh, oh yeah, the dumb bitch. Yeah, she went to that college. I think it's a uh, big star for him. I forgot what city it was, but she was in her. She was in her college. Miami? No, no. Like, no, there's a Miami University. Oh, oh, that's what Ben Rossberg. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, it's Miami. It's a school of Richmond. It was Miami from the uh, Native American yeah. uh, uh, gag. Yeah, it's um, Miami versus full of Richmond. Oh, yeah, it's probably there because uh, it's like walking around there. Uh, the campus was good. Yeah, right. Right. People were looking at this thing. That's the thing. Okay. That's, that's cool. Info Wars are lost. They got damn minds. This motherfucker got back in the uniform. That's Jacob, man. Holding a sign feet. He got a sign feet. Oh, he right with them. He with them. Big right there. Stop it. Uh, oh, is he just talking about that uh, Alex Jones bitch? What about her though? I was gonna say something. Oh, she's from Ohio? Yeah. I, I still, I'm still smashed up. Yeah, I hope that bitch Yeah, that's evil, man. Yeah. They cuss, they got her good, though. They got her good, though. They cuss her ass out. They try to be patient, patient with her. The info words is fake as hell. That's that one that GMS can't be. No, it wasn't. No. But uh, info words is fake as hell. That's just not even. He, Alex Jones, he don't even believe none of that shit, I don't think. Uh, right, I agree with that. I, I mean, he, but maybe, but he's doing it all for money. Right, right. Uh, he's doing, that's why he got what he got when he uh, lost that uh, lawsuit. They always believe that. They only more it to Because he know damn well Sandy Hook really uh, was really an inside job. We already know that. But he got, they sued his ass. He, you know, he lost all kind of money. That's what you get, man. Because he getting everybody else's money, taking advantage of people. Oh, that's... He always using the name of Jesus and trying to read scriptures. So he's essentially teaching for filthy lucre's sake. Right? What? It's higher than that. That, 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 that was true to them. That mean all the white people, 99% of the men were and helped us. It's a bit easy to set the so-called black free. That's not that It's crazy. Crazy. <laughs> they do say that most of the uh, a, lo uh, a big percentage of the slave owners are Edomite. Uh, well, they're all Edomites. <laughs> uh, the Amalekites are fake Jews, so-called, and they don't never they get a free pass on it. They they try to blend in with Jake, like oh we, we share your struggle. Everybody hates Jews, just like they hate y'all. <laughs> you don't know they hate y'all because y'all motherfuckers are the devil. That's a special hatred. Yeah, there's a reason they hate you motherfuckers. They got all good shape, a lot of good shape. There's a reason Henry Ford Skin hated heads. your ass. Skinheads. Skinheads hate you. There don't nobody like them motherfuckers. I think, I think the KKK. I think the only people that like Ju fake Jews is fucking Jake. That's it. The Nazis ain't playing that shit. Oh, shit. They got a special their kingdom. This is supposed to be their kingdom. Well, nobody trusts them motherfuckers. Nah, go ahead. Oh, let me finish this. And in the morning thou shalt say, with the most high for even, and at even thou shalt say, with the most high for the morning. For, for the fear of thine heart, wherewith thou shalt fear, and for the sight of thy eyes, where thou shalt see. We have another fear out here. And that's our mind. Like, thinking, hey, the most I can punish me now or punish me today. I always think that, man. The most I'm looking at you, man. At least he's trying. Man. I hope that's how he's right, right. <laughs> You know what I mean? Woo. It's like, You're at least trying, man. You got to watch a guy who's not afraid. <laughs> a, a guy that don't fear the Lord, you can't trust that that's guy. Me. Well, a guy a, yeah, a guy who thinks he's perfect that's and me. he's always good. If you think you're good, man, you're in the wrong spirit. That's a nasty name. Yeah, they, they all that overly, uh, they appear. I want to get, there's so many scriptures popping in my head. You see what happened to Long Stroke Eddie Long? No fear of the Lord. No fear of the Lord. I got a scripture for that. We in the spirit, bro. We were back and forth on all kinds of subjects. We, we on one subject. It's called the spirit. That's right. That's right. Uh, Oh, here it is right here. Woe, uh, this is uh, Matthew 23 and 27. Woe unto you, scribes and Pharisees, hypocrites, for ye are like unto whited sepulchers, which indeed appear beautiful outward, but are within full of dead men's bones and of all uncleanliness. Even so, ye also outwardly appear righteous unto men, 
but within you are full of hypocrisy and iniquity. So, hey, that's like them guys, was that last week? They was making fun of us because the way we was out dressing out here. They was like, I look at y'all garments. How y'all look homeless? You know what I mean? You know, people making fun of us. And you go to them scriptures when the most high speaks to them, being brotherly and, yeah. and being peaceful. That, it hits you, it touches you, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's the spirit I've been in. That <laughs> I've been really thinking about that, man. It's like these people are not brotherly. And you got a lot of Israelites teaching to know the truth. They're not brotherly. Like they'll look down upon us with the way we look. They don't believe the lies of Nathaniel and IUIC because what? They look nice on the outside. And that's that script, but it's, on the inside, they full of dead men's bones. Right, and then brother, you know, see a brother in need, you don't scoff at him. <laughs> All right, yeah, give me a better garment <laughs> then, right? Fucking rats. Yeah, the scripture that James says, like, the brother needs something. You don't just say, oh, I hope you do well. I you just help that brother. Help that brother, man. Especially, uh, I read that verse in Proverbs, which says, fucking man. That's great. I read that scripture in Proverbs, says, if you, if you knock the cord, uh, you're, you're reproaching outside. The, 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 the scripture says the Lord hears the. Uh, he, uh, the Lord said he hears the he uh, he hears the, the cry of the poor more than the people in the world. You know? And the will of the Father this so Yeah, so yeah. And they out here true. crying too. Motherfuckers in pain out here. But you, man, fuck these people. Bunch of assholes in this world. And that's the main thing. What did the Lord say? Uh, with a Matthew 22, the two main commandments, the first commandment is to love the Lord that God with all their mind yeah. and with all their soul. And, and the second greatest commandment is what? To love your brother, right? He said of all the, on these two commandments hang all the law and the prophets. Jeremiah 5 and 25. Your iniquities have turned away these things, and your sins have withholden these things from you. For among my people are found wicked men. Among my people are found wicked men. And that's really talking about, that's talking about the Israelites. And you have people who know they're Israelites. They'll be out here teaching them. Y'all might see they be wearing purple. They all got their own colors. <laughs> That's some wicked. I U I C wicked as hell, man. They, that's just evil. Evil. It's obviously evil. But that tells you why. Well, he's talking about that perception. Jake lacked perception. Yeah. Same thing. You see them evil niggas in the corner selling dope. I U I C got that same vibration, man. Oh, they selling. They selling man. dope. Yeah. That's evil dope. Niggas. I be damn, man. I pull over just want to get out and hang with them niggas, man. What's up, brother? Hanging them, stay on the corner with them. But they act got weird spirits. You can't even kick them with. Them. Don't you should go to the highways and byways and teach the word, man. Don't go to the highways and byways and fucking hang out. Here we go. And for among my people who found wicked men, they lay wait. As he that can set a snare, they set a trap, they catch men. I <laughs> see caught a whole lot of men. And women. Women. Some bitches as a cage is full of words. So are their houses full of deceit. Therefore, they are become great and wax rich. And one of the main deceit, they, they blast me the name of the Lord. They brought, that's the Ten Commandments. They should not take the the, the, the name of the Yahweh in vain. And they blast me the Lord. They make fun of his name. Yeah, it's on video. When they that's greet each other, they say the Most High Christ bless. Yeah. They got a video, it's on that. Make, make, making, he wrote it on the brick, in the wilderness, somewhere in the woods, making fun of the Lord's name. He gonna have a disastrous end. Shit. Well, hey. I won't be near him when it comes in. They gonna be gruesome, well, that's man. That's gonna be vicious. Now, you can't even play around with something like that. That's not. That's not something to mess with. Definitely. Especially he knows. Somebody dropping bricks. Bob, what's up? They are waxing fat. But that they let, shine. But that show you right there who the Israel proves who the Israelites are. Yep. Well, or something like that, that I think. <laughs> I don't know. No, no other nation on earth is built like it. Look at the Israelite woman. The other heathen nations ain't built like the Israelite woman. And there be some bad bitches built on heathen nations, but they still be on the show. Because the Israelite woman come out with that. Woo! When you see that ass boy, you're like, ah, damn. 
Because we teaching the script. That nigga got some facial recognition camera. Well, he's like taking pictures of monkeys at the zoo. That's what it, it's what it's like in his mind. That was that was like a that was like a ten thousand dollar camera he had. I can't even afford a new camera. He saw a guy just fly shit. Hey, he doing dumb shit with his camera. That's some bullshit. That's all right though, cause the most high, but his word's still getting out, you know what I mean? You know, Esau get this expensive ass camera equipment making some dumb ass videos. Bro, give me a camera like that, bro. We gonna be look, we be in super 4K out here, you know what I mean? That shit do look good on video. That shit look good, bro. Yeah, with the, the, uh, the background be a little blurry, you know how we focus? What's that called, the DSLR cameras Chris. and all that? Mosquitoes. Uh-oh. It's almost skeeter season. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Shit, the skeeters is already here. Look at them. He saw skeeters. They, they, they really look. can't enjoy the outdoors. Oh, he, the mosquitoes. That's how you who the devil is. The mosquitoes hate Esau. Well, yeah. um, those uh, elites, like uh, the queen, they, there's an actual plant that emit a smell. Yeah. I can't remember the name of my wife down there, though. I'm not going to buy them. I'm going to take the but they do have that plant surrounding their properties. Lavender? Lap, that's it. It's lavender. Yeah. I take the lavender. Mosquitoes don't really mess with me, though. But, uh... I think if you eat a lot of sugar, though, bugs fuck with you more. A lot of sugar? There's a bad one. I always heard the bugs are attracted. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it is. <laughs> he pointed at it. He was like, "Wow, they are waxing fat. They shine. Gay. They overpass the deeds of the wicked." That's Israel. They overpass the deeds of the wicked. Now, on the outside, like groups like IUIC, to the average retard that don't know nothing, they never heard no scriptures in their life. They be like, "Oh, that sounds right." You know what I mean? But nah, they really overpassing the deeds of the wicked. You don't see Esau making videos on YouTube, blast that make them fun of the name of the Most High. No, that's something Israel gonna do. And he gonna do it over and over. Here, bro, we're gonna give you a shirt look just like mine. Yeah, everybody all uniform. That's something Esau would do too, huh? Everybody gotta look exactly alike. They put it on and make they talk. Yeah, you look good in it, man. We all got different spirits. You know, brother got different garments, you know, different spirits in it. Some brothers come out with a camouflage garment, you know what I mean? Hey, you do what you wanna do. As long as you got them fringes and border of blue. Yeah, they probably, yeah, he made fun of his garment he was wearing last week because he said it looked like a poncho. So, I mean, what do, what do you think if we, if we dress like ancient Israelites, like, like we did in the ancient world? We will come out here wearing white linen with a border, but it'd be all one, we'd be wearing uh, tunics. Is that what they call tunics? Like robes. We didn't even wear pants in the ancient world. Cause you know where pants come from. The Germanic people is the one who uh, introduced pants. Cause they was living up north in the cold weather. It's cold up there. You can't wear a robe up there. You gotta have some pants. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's why you're supposed to wear the robe, actually. Just saying you wear a robe, you can probably feel a lot better. <laughs> and that's why we always go into it. That's why the scripture says, when it says, gird up that loins, that means you take that robe and you, tie, you pull it up, tie it up, get ready to go to battle. But just think, if we came out here dressed like the scripture commanded, 
get a script. He's making, he's making fun of our garments. Let's go, Bill Gates. Yeah, uh, Gates. But the scriptures say your garment's supposed to be made out of the same material, right? And who's doing that? Ain't nobody doing that. So our socks are probably made out of a different material than our pants, and you know, I don't know what the hell this shit's made out of. It's cotton. I don't know. Oh my God! That's crazy. That's crazy. I'm not getting. It. I don't want to mess up my camera. I was what did he make the rims himself? That's what happens when somebody in the hands of Oh wow. I ain't funny my camera. I don't wanna if I turn my camera, it might mess up. That's what happens when the hands of got that's that tax money. That's another thing with tape. Yeah, it's ugly. That shit gotta be rubbing. That's how you like see from. What is it like 28 inch rims? That's ugly as fuck. He said how you like that's the IUIC mobile. They got they like got like a Batmobile. The Nate mobile. And what's the other dude from ISP UK? I I don't IS Too many letters, bro. They said he was rolling around some expensive ass cars too. The head guy. I know, I, know, uh, I know Comfy was. That nigga had two buybacks. backs. My back? Yeah, I said my back. Buybacks. Buybacks. <laughs> Shit, I bet the, 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 the probably the police auction there. Did he go to jail? Two years. You sure? Quick as hell. I, I, didn't, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't get. He got that money to postpone it for three years. Damn. I didn't. That's funny if he did though. I'm gonna have to go find that out for sure. Because you, that's the main guys I've been seeing in Columbus. Is the uh, I don't even know what the hell the group is called. The the Universal okay. Church or what? I'm talking about Comfies. That that's actually the, the original school. But everybody left them because they're wicked as hell. So you got a guy calling himself the comforter. They didn't, they weren't wearing all those same garments like this. Nah, nah. What's Moses? Oh, he's gonna turn into a serpent. Hey, I forgot. No, we just all over the place. It's all good. We can talk about the fear of the Lord. We don't got the fear of the Lord. It's, uh, the first one read this one. Uh, it says, uh, second piece. 17 and 25 says, so was, and so was at the beginning of the dwelling there that they feared not Yahweh, therefore I was sent lions among them to slew some of them. Ooh. Now you can imagine getting eaten by a lion, that gotta be terrifying. But now the Lord gonna send some even more fierce lions on y'all ass. You know, you call Esau. You know what I'm saying? Oh, y'all see that new creature they found there? I have like 80 something tentacles. Damn, was that the Kraken? That's what fucking sound like the Kraken. They found the fossil, bro. What do they call that? Uh, Whatever it is, it's not extinct. What is that shit? Davy Jones and Martin? Yeah, because the Vikings and all them, the Greeks, are, oh, it's in the scripture. Leviathan, there's all kind of weird creatures up in the ocean. There's a whole lot of shit in the depths that don't come the surface. Like Aquaman. <laughs> There's a mermaid. Aquaman's not real, man. <laughs> <laughs> right. you know, who is that pushing mermaids though? Oh, oh yeah, G G O C C. Yeah, there is somebody actually pushing mermaids. Look, I seen a video that had like a wedding in Hawaii or some shit. That shit was like some CGI or something. The same shit. How you guys see that? How you got uh, Nate was on the boat recording himself on a yacht or some shit? Not yacht. Ready, big ass boat. Yeah. yeah. See, yeah. You First of all, you go over it. I got time for that. Most High Christ bless Israel. He, he's a thespian, not a thespian. He's not a thespian. Theo means God. He's an actor. 
Um, Israel. Yeah, in Israel. Um, yes. Israel. Um. I didn't know Jake liked people to talk like that. I thought they didn't. Like, damn, that, he acting kind of gay. We you know what I mean? Kind of fruity, ain't he? We're in the world now. I guess that's why they like it. Cause he won't even talk. You know, that's why money, money makes you talk like that. He been living that high life. Cause you know, you watch uh, Nate's videos from 10 years ago, he wasn't talking like that. He had a more stern voice, but now he's like, oh, yeah, go back even further. oh, Israel. Yeah, go back even further, bro. I heard that motherfucker before he told me. Yeah. Nate, man, when he was, where, when he was a gadite. He was like a gadite. He was a gadite. Oh, shit. Sound like he suffers from uh, uh, multiple personality disorder. Glass, I a glass one. The one dude that's fighting Samuel Jackson and Unbreakable? Yeah. We're unbreakable, yeah. The new one, though. The I ain't seen the new one. The white dude, the crazy dude, he's got different personalities. I ain't seen it. They bring them all together. Samuel Jackson, him, they go all fight with uh, Bruce Willis. And... <laughs> you already seen that shit? I saw the first one. Wait a minute, oh. I saw the second one, too. Because that shit was dope as fuck. They caught you up, there's something unexpected. It's some unexpected type shit. Pretty... No, I ain't seen the new one. He's always taking pictures, bro. I think he was in the picture. He was like that one nigga, uh, you know, hell, he's still alive. He's like that nigga, uh, you know, that, that scientist nigga? I forgot his name, that black nigga. Oh, uh, no, that, 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 that's still, uh, no, the grass Tyson. <laughs> Priscilla, that's so fucking fat. Huh? Priscilla? No, he's dark. Oh, uh, that's his wife. Uh, no, no. Uh, I said Chris so, uh, uh, Yeah, I forgot her name. Michael Jackson here. Yeah, fuck it. She's fat as fuck. Yeah, she she looks kind of hot, but she looks like Elvis too much. I think she looks like Elvis. Really? She got that lip. Her lip is going up. Like that. Uh, Lisa, Lisa Marie. That's it. Elvis is shit though, baby. Then you have assholes. Like I guarantee you get an IUIC people out here, they're gonna say Elvis Presley is an Edomite. They gonna say that. Most, you know what I mean? Respectful people. That's the shit you gotta deal with, man. They gonna say, call me an Edomite. You get tired of hearing that shit. Man, they need it. Yeah, like last week, them dudes came out here making fun of our garments. They didn't see me at first, but this shit was in the way. But when they see me, they, oh, you got a white boy with you. You got an Edomite with you. That's what gives them the wind that they work in this life. That's some asshole shit, man. They have beards and shit. I'm telling you, it has to be. Fucking asshole. Yeah, yeah, they go, nobody yeah. else says garments, right? So, most of Time in it, uh, right. but, yeah. 
Oh, that's that Jeremiah 16. Oh, look at it. Yeah, we ain't read that in a minute. What is this black guy here? We've actually been using it a lot, though. Oh, for real? Yeah. We might go to New Orleans. Uh, we used to read that scripture every day. Yeah. Yeah. Come in. Right, get, I'm gonna get this real quick. Uh, John 7 and 14, uh, 24. Judge not according to appearance, but judge righteous judgments. And we've been going at that for a minute. Because every in this world we live in, everything's based upon appearance. You're not a good person unless you dress nice. You know what I mean? You're not accepted by society unless you look good, dress good, you got money. You got you got to have some Jordans on. If you're wearing some uh, Walmart shoes, you're gonna get clowned out the room. Oh, you gotta have some nice shoes. If you're wearing operating shit, people make fun of you. You know, fuck these people, man. And then if you like the Israelites, they judge by according to appearance. Like this asshole called me a white boy. You know what I mean? Fuck these people, man. I'll go ahead with that. Right, so right, we fishing right now. But soon when the Lord gave that power, we're gonna be we gonna he gonna put power, we're gonna get actual power. We're gonna meet the Lord in the air, we're gonna be changed, we're gonna be like him. He's gonna give us power, and then we're gonna turn into hunter. He's gonna put his spirit on us. And just like that, we're not gonna spare uh, old, <laughs> young, man, woman. Shit. If they got a dog with him, we're gonna kill him too. Yep. <laughs> yes. A horse. Oh, that reminds me of, uh, you seen that Clint Eastwood movie, The Unforgiven? And the end of the movie is, I'm going to shoot all your sons of bitches. I'm going to shoot you. I'm going to burn your house down. I'm going to shoot your dog. Yeah, you take a shot. <laughs> coming back to kill you, your families, your children, the cattle. Yeah, that's the right script. The scripture yeah, yeah. sent us in the lands, and he said, you destroy everything, even the gold, all that yeah, shit. Yeah, he killed the animals and fuck that day. That's it, angry. That's mad. And he that's said, angry. you can not even allow to keep nothing either. Nothing. And then we fuck up. Yeah, one up, one guy. All it takes is one. Right. Uh, all it takes. Yeah. That's yep. anger, man. That's real anger, man. We'll destroy the fucking everything, everything. Yo, destroy everything. That's, anger. That's righteous anger. Yeah. The dude stole that, that bubble on his garment. Dude yeah. even burned his goddamn tent. He burned his tent. His, his, his <laughs> daughter and cattle and every goddamn thing. Oh, shit. That shit, fire cleanses. How do you think you get rid of a, a, the stench of a heathen? You gotta burn it. Look at America. How do you think you're going to cure the disease called America? How do you think you're going to burn? How do you think you're going to destroy uh, this image? That's going to be burned with fire. It has to be burned with fire. Burned with fire. It has, it has to be It has to be destroyed. So why are you carrying a Bible in your hand if you want to burn that? That's not in the Bible. Can you show me the scripture for that? Show me that. The Bible. Right the Bible. The Bible is real, dude. Okay, what's this? I know. The Bible? We're, we're teaching it. Show us where in the Bible, where that is in the Bible. Such as? This being a, when you been, look, being a red man, being, being, being a leprous. Being Have a, a long hair. First off, you have to remember something. What I can remember? Remember the fact that that wasn't what he really looked like. We know that. That's why we said to burn it. He told you. He told you. Poof, went over there. <laughs> hey, the scriptures had no graven images, too. Yeah, well, that's what do you guys got right here? That's the information. This is the information. This isn't a real tattoo. It's not a real one. No. Just purple. You got a licking stick. He's just purping with a tattoo. You know what that stands for? Purping. Take with your tattoo. Bible and read. Read Luke 15:4. Why don't you read it for me? Why don't you get a Bible out and read it? You ain't got a Bible on you. I ain't got no Bible on you. Well, you just you come know, to that's it. That's going to happen right there in real life. With your hands. You know, Luke Cage made out of you know. Maybe we ought to have you take a little stop right out there at the World Harvest Church. World Harvest Church. I'll be keeping you guys. I'll be keeping you guys. I'll be keeping you guys. I'll be keeping you guys in my prayers bigger than that. Are you the ambassador of the World Church? Listen, every one of you, shut up and listen. Shut up and listen. Where's your scriptures at? No, you shut up. Where's your scriptures at? Listen, the bottom line is simply this. 
Shut you up. understand? You need to listen. Because you guys are, are you the a very prophet? people. Are you, you guys shit. are the very ones that will be burning in hell for all Let me ask you a question. No, one question. Let's say it, chill. Let me ask you a question. Are you an Israelite? I'm more of what God calls me to be. Yes or no? Are you a, are you an Israelite? Are you an Israelite? Yes, I am. Israelites. The Lord and the Lord came to save the Israelites, right? He came to save everybody that was lost. Who said it? Who? Well, lost. Romans. No. Let me read the scripture. Everyone that like was lost. Let me show you. Uh, one real quick. Cause uh, old Rob Parsley in life, he's just getting your money, so he's living a good life. You're not. Matthew 15, 24, but he answered and said, I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So the Lord's on dealing with the Israelites. Okay, and you said you're not an Israelite. So the Lord's not dealing with you. Simple, plain, clear. Matthew's 10 and 6, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Right? Okay, so why are you bringing that stuff out? Because I'm showing you that you don't know what you're talking about. Because the Lord only came to save the lost sheep of the house of Israel. You're telling us to go to World Harvest Church, which is obviously just, a, they just in there getting everybody's money. I watch the show, you gotta sow your seed of faith. And make sure them tithes keep coming, boy. I mean, go, ahead, go pay your tithes, bro, go ahead. Give them all your money. Go sell your house, give it to the church. Here you go, Acts 7 and 48. How be it, the most high dwelleth not in temples made with hands. Most high dwelleth not in temples made with hands. That's, that's, that's why the Lord burned down that Notre Dame church. That's right. We, we applauded that. We clapped. What about the uh, Mark chip, the thing that's going to happen? That's the Mark chip. It's, it's already happening. Right. Right. But the, but the, but the, the stage is being set where it's leading to it being mandatory, though. You right. hear me? Well, you know, this right here represents leaving the 99 and getting the one. Each one of you guys need Jesus, the real Jesus, not the one you guys been professing, not okay. the one that you guys been. We can take that. Because you know why? Because I've been doing ministry for, listen, I've been doing ministry for 30 years, okay? You've been doing what? I've been doing ministry for 30 years. I've been, what you know that? For one, I don't have my Bible with me. You don't need no Bible. You can't quote it? Yeah. And you said the Lord came to save everybody, didn't we? He came to save that which was lost. And we read it. Who was lost? The lost right there is It's going to happen. Remember your scripture for you, sir? This, this we is, know about that. This is, go ahead, go ahead. This is Romans 9 and 4. Who are Israelites to whom pertain? I know, we're starting at the top. Sorry. This is too much for this guy. No, 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 just read. Not really, well, because I, say I think I want you guys to read this one right here, Luke 15, 4. Well, let me, let me yeah, we'll, we'll get that, actually. We'll get that. Listen to this, and we'll get that. I say the truth from the Messiah, I lie at night. My conscience also bearing me witness. Oh, you should in never the do spirit. that. I told you too much. Oh, you guys should that never do that. great yeah. heaviness yeah. and That's a world harvest right there. Come on, listen, focus. Man. It says that I might have great uh, heaviness and continuous sorrow in my heart. This is Paul said he had great heaviness and continuous sorrow in his heart. Go ahead. I could wish that myself were a curse from the Messiah for my brethren. For, for his brethren. Go, my, go ahead. My kinsmen according to the flesh. My kinsmen according to the flesh. Go ahead. Who are Israelites. Who are Israelites. This is Paul speaking. Who are, he said his brothers are Israelites. Go ahead. To whom pretend if the adoption. The adoption. Oh, that Gentiles got adopted in. Well, Israel scattered among all nations. So the adoption pertain uh, to Israel. Go ahead. And the glory, yeah, the glory, really and the covenant, and the covenants. So he said the covenants pertain to Israel. And what was the Lord said? This is the blood of the New Testament. What's the word the, testament mean? New covenant. So okay, covenant. So it says this covenant. The new covenant, old covenant. For what Israel. Do you think old testament is. Old testament is old covenant. New testament is new. New covenant. Okay. So the Lord said this is the testament that, that this is the testament shed for uh for for many, right? So obviously he just said the the covenant is for Israelites. For Israelites. So that new covenant, that new testament is for the only for the Israelites. For the Israelites. Okay, you can read so that in Hebrews 8 and uh was it 8 I forgot where it's at. It says he shall make a new covenant with uh, the house of Jacob yeah. and the house of Judah and Israel. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pray for it. But it says there's even more. In the giving of the law and the service of God. So only the ones that can do the work is the Israelites. Okay. It says, in the promises, which is the kingdom of heaven, whose are the fathers, and of whom as concerning the flesh. The Messiah came. Woo he said he came for the nation of Israel. Yeah, the world, world Harvest Church is not teaching that. What they're teaching is so you can see your faith. Hey, so that seat. Hey, Sister Mary, look under your that chair. That sounds crazy. It's a hundred dollar bill for you. Like, I mean, this is a so let's ask you again. That's Are you Israelite? Are you Israelite now? 
First off, let me explain something to you guys. Uh oh. Now we, we gotta explain what we just read. Okay, you can't let go of that explanation. You trying to just yes. skip you trying to you trying to dodge the bullets. No, because what I see here garbage. Okay, good. This is all garbage good. right here. Good. This here. Well, I got a scripture for that. So, is that Romans 9 he read? Was that garbage? No, but I want you to read that. So, what does it mean? You got read it. What does it Let's not jump. What is it? What scripture is that? I want you to read Luke 15 4. Because you, you, you don't want to ask us to read scripture. They ain't not you. Are you going to answer? They don't cut me. They're cutting you. Was Paul going off? Was Paul tripping? What does he mean by that? No. Paul was a. You know, Paul was one who not only was he a Gentile, but no, check no, this no, out. No, he was seeking the Gentiles. No, he was one who persecuted the Gentiles. He was the one who persecuted the Gentiles until God got his attention. Oh, no. Paul go. persecuted Gentiles? The Christians. He persecuted the Christians, yeah. Well, obviously, you need to understand that Paul was one persecuting all the Christians. We know this. Okay, what happened to Paul? He got knocked off his horse and right. went blind. And uh, the Lord spoke and, to him. Ananias. And the Lord spoke to him in the Hebrew tongue because, yeah. he, because the Lord is an Israelite. Why did the Lord have 12 disciples? Lord, check this out. You're actually videotaping. World Harvest videotapes you. They, the Lord had 12 disciples. What does that represent? 12 disciples. Adios, devil. You know what? Anybody call somebody a devil? I shot ton. Remember one thing: when three fingers are pointing back. Did you know the scripture says the wicked fleeth? Hey, I point them all at you. No man pursuing. The wicked fleeth. Uh, 30 years, you don't know a damn thing. God damn. Oh, all that stuff. That's how I start knowing. Road runner. Let's call him the road runner. That's the road runner. What's his road name? Road runner. Maybe. Resist.